friends good morning welcome to my channel balu master today's shortcut i think you can guess it is completely depends on yesterday's limit x tends to 0 secant px minus secant qx by secant rx minus secant sx this is equals to limit x tends to 0 first i'm going to derive the proof then i'm going to apply that formula as for problems limit x tends to 0 1 by secant px can be written as 1 by cos px minus 1 by cos qx whole by 1 by cos rx minus 1 by cos sx this is equals to limit x tends to 0 cos qx minus cos rx if you take lcm you are getting by cos px into cos qx into if you take the denominator and take ulta you are getting cos rx into cos sx by cos sx minus cos rx now limit extends to a f of x into g of x is there means we can able to express limit extends to a f of x into limit extends to a g of x that is a property of limits and moreover what i am going to do here limit extends to 0 cos qx minus cos px by this is a multiplication that's what you can able to write anywhere that's what i want to write cos sx minus cos rx is here into limit extends to 0 according to property i am splitting like this cos rx into cos sx by cos px into cos qx Understood. This is equals to. Now, if you see, yes, that is the formula we discussed in shortcut number five. The formula is limit x tends to zero cos q x minus cos r p x by cos s x minus cos r x is equals to. The formula is q square minus p square by s square minus r square. If you have any doubt, just you look at the description. So I was keeping on the description box. So now this is what q square minus p square by s square minus r square according to formula into. If you see limit x tends to zero cos function is going on. If you substitute here, the result will become one. Now if you take a common negative sign in the numerator and denominator, then you cancel. You are getting p square minus q square by r square minus s square. You get. Understood. Then this is your answer. If you see, friends, secant px means uh, secant rx, secant sx, secant sx. Very easy formula. P square minus q square by r square minus s square. That's all the formula. Okay. So now we are going to see multiple problems. Look it. Friends, can you try the examples? Yes. This is equals to the formula is limit x tends to 0 secant px minus secant qx plus secant rx minus secant sx equal to p square minus q square by r square minus s square. That's what this is nothing but 3 square minus 2 square by 4 square minus 3 square. That's what 9 minus 4 by 16 minus 9. You are getting 5 by 7. 5 by 7 is your answers. Friends, just 2 seconds enough to complete this sum. Similarly, if you want to solve this sum, secant limit x tends to 0, secant 8x minus secant 9x by secant 7x minus secant 10x is equal to 8 square minus 9 square by 7 square minus 10 square. For example, if you feel the calculation is lengthy, then you should go a square minus b square formula a plus b into a minus b. That's what a plus 9 into a minus 9 by 7 plus 10 into 7 minus 10. Then this is what you are going to write 17 into minus 1 by 17 into minus 3. Then 17, 17 get cancelled and minus minus get cancelled. You are getting the answer is 1 by 3. Hardly 2 seconds or 3 seconds. It's very easy problem friends. Thank you. Thank you very much for today.